Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Game 3 of all-time teams. We've already done the Seattle Mariners, and we've done the St. Louis Cardinals. We're off for two, unfortunately, but hopefully we'll get a win with Game number 3, which is the Baltimore Orioles. Take a look at the team real quick. In the outfield, we got Christian Walker, Cedric Mullins, and Anthony Santander. Infield, we got Brooks Robinson, Cal Ripken Jr., Brian Roberts, and one guy that I just picked up about less than an hour ago, 99, Eddie Murray, who should be pretty good for this team. And behind the dish, we got Adley Rutschman. On the bench, we got Trey Mancini, Jose Iglesias, Harold Baines, Jim Tomei, and Gunnar Henderson. For the pitching staff, we got Grayson Rodriguez, Mike Mucina, Jim Palmer, Robin Roberts, and Fernando Valenzuela. And in the bullpen, we got Felix Bautista, Zach Britton, Darren O'Day, Jorge Lopez, Dylan Tate, Evan Phillips, Lee Smith, and Andrew Miller rounding it out. One thing I'm going to say before we get into the gameplay, um, there are going to be some teams that I don't have the greatest cards for. I don't have every card in the game. I'm, for the most part, no money spent. So some cards that are for BR, more specifically, I'm probably not going to have most of them. So, we're going to use what I got. If I can get them, I will try. But, I'm not going to guarantee that I'm going to have the greatest cards for every team. But I am going to try my best. So, with that being said, and the team being shown, let's get into the game. And hopefully we'll break our losing streak. Two. And that is an amazing start. No, we're going to hold that one. Oh my god, Cal Ripken Jr. to the moon! That is an unbelievable start, holy shit. Santander. Santander with a base hit up the middle, there we go. We got a base hit, we got a two run jack, we got another base hit. Belbury of Cedric Mullins, the 90 overall, so let's see what he can do. He can line into a double play. That's what he can do. And that is going to pop out. Okay. Hey, but you know what? We got two. Nice pitch. That was brought. Run away. Nice pitch. Of the, uh, the audio. Just to sort of be able to hear me a little bit more. Because I felt like I was getting lost in the audio of the background and everything else. I did not have the um, the visual for the hitting. I finally turned it back on. And we're up by three as Adley Rutschman hits a home run. Never mind. Sinker. Got me. Okay. Hey, we're up by three going bottom two. I'm feeling good. Times out of a million, this pitch is going to get him. I mean, it did. He just sort of huge shot it. Or Q shot it. And my trout's going to beat that out. Don't go two, just go one. Two away. Two going to miss. Got him. Hey, what a two strong innings for it. Grayson Rodriguez. And Cal's two for two. A home run and a single for Cal Ripken Jr. And a double play. Wow. That is the second double play I've had. That was a line drive. That was a line drive one hopper to short. And then the one with Mullins was a line drive caught by the first baseman for a double play. Speaking of doing more, Brooks Robinson. He does more. Jesus, that's a bomb. What is that, 460? 451, Brooks Robinson. Jesus, that's a shot. And Adley goes deep to right field. Going back is the right fielder. 
He's going to dive and not make the play. And that's going to be a two-out double for Adley Rutschman. Change up. Swung and a miss. Strike three. And the inning is over. But the Orioles do fight back for another run. Look at bottom four. The Orioles up four nothing. Go to pitch. Swung and a miss. Strike three. Yo, ground ball the first, actually. That change your pungo a little bit. It's fine. As long as I get the result that I want. The 0-2 pitch. Swung and a miss. Strike three. Fifth strikeout for Grayson Rodriguez. The three and two thirds. 0-2 pitch by Rodriguez. Is a cutter low under the zone. Ripped into right for a base hit. Here's the first pitch to Brian Roberts. And the pitch is swung on him left the left center field. And that ball is not coming back. Another home run for the Orioles. I believe it's their third of the day. And it's 5-0. Now I'm going to have Cal Ripken. And you got Adley. And you may have another off the bat of Ripken. Going back left field. And that ball is gone. Home run number five for the Orioles as Ripken with his second of the day. And the pitch is grounded once again to first base, not even on the PCI, which results in an out. Nothing. As Brian Reynolds swings at the first pitch, hits a deep fly to right. Santander is there, and there's one away. The 0-2 to Witt. Swung on a missed on a slider, barreling down in the way. Throw to first in time, two away. Swung on a missed. The 0 1 is popped into shallow center field. Brian Roberts, the second baseman, is there. And that'll end the fifth inning. And I believe this man has given up as Sean Green is now the new pitcher in the ballgame. First pitch is lined into left field, and I believe that's going to do it. Oh, maybe not. And Grayson Rodriguez with a great swing, lined to left field. Oh. And Cal Ripken's going to hammer it to right center field. That's going to find the gap. It's going to go over the gap, actually. And it's going to be a three-run home run. His third home run of the game. As Cal is leading this team with an offensive explosion. And Santander hits a high fly, deep left field. The left fielder going back at the track. He's at the wall. And that ball is gone. Another home run for this Baltimore Orioles offense. I understand it is a max elevation stadium. But the offense that I've been dealing with the last two games has been downright atrocious and Cedric Mullins is going to get an opposite field double. This this team can muster as Murray's going to send one to deep center field and that ball is going to be gone. Now Eddie Murray wants to join the party. A 420 shot to dead center. Brian Reynolds is all that's left. First pitch is a high fly ball. Deep right center. Mullins is on the move. A way back. A way back. And he will make the running play to end the ball game as the Baltimore Orioles just put on an explosion of an offense. 12 nothing. your final. As you're looking at the box score, three home runs for Ripken. Home run for Santander, Roberts, Murray, Robinson, and Rutschman. There was eight home runs hit from the Baltimore Orioles in this game. That, I mean, the offense was sort of struggling to get going, but that was an incredible jump start for the offense in this series. I'm surprised and happy. But yeah, that's it for this video. Let's go see who our next team's gonna be. Three down, 27 to go. Let's see who we got for spin number four. And the winner is the Chicago Cubs. Very nice. We're heading down to Chi-Town.